guys welcome back to my channel i am here with baby megan and i'm gonna be changing her and talking about the dawn teddy bear show and i'm gonna change her into this cute little dress it is mini mouth so let's get straight to it did i buy anything from the dawn teddy bear show and how was it so my experience was very positive i had a great experience i went in thinking that i was just going to kind of cover up the stroller so no one can actually see in until i got inside the actual room the don teddy bear show itself because it's at a hotel by our airport it was at the claritin hotel by the philadelphia international airport and that didn't go as planned i was confident which i surprised myself um, confident enough, she was never covered, not one time. My first reaction was actually we met a lady in the the bathroom. And she got a glimpse of her and she was like, oh, she's so cute. And I'm like, she's a doll. And then she looked and she was like, oh my goodness. So anyway, a lot of people's reaction was so fun. I wish I got everyone's reaction on camera, but I didn't. Um, the best reaction was from this, she was like a teenager, young teenage girl on the way out. Her, and I guess that was her friend, they were actually outside of the hotel. And she like looked, and then she looked again, and then she just kept looking, and I was like, it's a doll. And then she came over, and she like touched her, and she felt her, and she was just like, I believe she was amazed and stunned. <laughs> um so a lot that was mainly everyone's reaction to her they just kept doing double takes and they weren't sure and then i would just tell them especially if i seen them um i'm surely there was other people who did a double take as well but i didn't see them and when i seen them i told them you know she's a doll blah 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 and i did get the one man's reaction on a video man i guess that was his wife she was asking a little bit of questions um, if you didn't see the doll show video, please go check that out. Actually, you can see some of the highlights of the show that's going to be on my TikTok as well. If you want to go check that out on TikTok, if you don't want to watch the whole doll show. Now, um, I have to say that when I first got there, I was a little bit disappointed because literally there was no dolls. <clears throat> um, there was figures and teddy bears, but n like, literally no dolls that I the kind that I collected. I knew they weren't going to have reborns, but I thought they would have, like, a American Girl, maybe, or some vintage. And they really was just, everything was teddy bears or animals and things like that. So I was a little bit disappointed about that. But all the people's reactions, I was just laughing and smiling and having a great time all day because of people's reactions to Sophia. But <clears throat> the downside is I wish they would have called it Teddy Bear Show or something else but not doll and teddy bear show because it definitely was not a doll and teddy bear show that's the only downfall i wish they would have you know changed it changed their name to just some something else it was just more like a teddy bear show now did i buy anything me personally no i did not buy anything like they had little bears like i want to say about this big and they wanted like a hundred dollars for it fifty dollars and for a little thing like that, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to pay that price. That's just too much for me. That's like a down payment on a Reborn, or I can get an American Girl, or even a Blythe doll. I can get a couple of Blythe dolls for like 100 So, no, um, I did not get anything, but my mom did. She got a cute little teddy bear, and I'll try to pop it up on the screen for you guys to see. I didn't want to bring her down so you guys can see her. And put her on the because my mom has her displayed already. And she came with a stand, which was great. And that one was reasonably priced. But I didn't see any that I really, really, like, had to have. Especially within the price ranges that they were. I did see a lot that I liked. And then they were, like, 200 and some dollars. And no. I cannot. No. No way. Sorry. I'd rather have a doll that I love versus a teddy bear just because I went to the show. Um, like I said, if they were more reasonably priced, then I would have gotten one, but no, we didn't get nothing. No, we didn't. 
So that's kind of the recap of it. I can tell you stories for days about people's reactions. <laughs> um, and I'm sorry if my laugh, laugh was so annoying. but And if and because I kept asking. Because I want to be respectful. Because I know a lot of people don't want to be on camera. Or they don't want their work to be shown on camera. So I kind of went to every booth and asked them. And I'm sorry if it got to be annoying. I just didn't know how to cut that part out. Um, because I'm still trying to work this new editing system that I have going on. Anyway, but other than that, everyone was so nice, so kind, so sweet. It was just overall a 100% great day. And I hope to go to another Don Teddy Bear show. I would love to. Um, we traveled about 30 minutes out to go here. But it, I think it was well worth it. I mean, I know I didn't get anything, but it was well worth, like, the laughter and it was just so much fun <clears throat> and I would do it again even if it means I didn't get anything you know now I'm so excited that I want to make videos to get reactions from people like reaction videos and I can't believe how confident I was like no lie every time that I take a doll out to like fill them my secret um, is that I always have an extra blanket and I cover the car seat up. And then when I go to film, I uncover. But I make sure no one's around. Um, because I was always afraid of such negative people's comments. But <clears throat> at the doll show, there was no negative comments. Like I said, everyone was so fascinated by her. They kept looking, looking. like They, they were like, whoa, is that a real baby or a fake? So... Um, I would suggest, I'll do a video about, because someone asked me if I was embarrassed to take my dog out, and no, um, it, me covering my dog at the store is because I don't want to get stopped and have a negative, um, effect, you know what I mean? So, that's why I didn't want to do that, that's why I didn't want to, that's why sometimes I cover my babies, but at the dog show, I, I felt so confident and... Just, I didn't. So, anyway. So, overall, I had so much fun. I would go again. But I just was disappointed about the selection that they had. And it kind of was a small show, too. It wasn't, like, this big... But I thought it was going to be kind of big. Because it was at, you know, a um hotel. But it was small. Not a lot of vendors. We didn't stay too long. Because, like I said, we I, we saw all the vendors. We saw every single... Everything that people had. So, we didn't really say that long. Anyway, um, so she's all dressed. So, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll see you in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.